And here we go. How is it going today? Lola, let's kill my Dwayne. My name's Jazz. We're Dwayne Jazz today. We have for you episode two review of Loki. Mm -hmm. I've been burning with glorious purpose. And you'll see that every, every, every time. Okay. Every episode. All right. Go All right. Ahead. Wait, before we even start the review, if you guys have any reaction requests or reviews, please follow us on our social media and the link in the description. Don't forget to subscribe. Let's dive on in. Where are we, where are we going to start? Well, now he's like, like in the beginning, they gave him like, you know, like his, uh, his TVA jacket, uh -huh. basically, and he felt like kind of mm -hmm. good in it. Like he had, he had the like little pop collar, so it right. kind of feels like his old like cloak and stuff. Mm -hmm. And but then they still put variant on the back, on the back because they need to let him know like we we still don't trust you, basically. I mean, who trusts Loki? As they shouldn't. Mm -hmm. So, um, but they're basically trying to just go and figure out what the other Loki's uh, mm -hmm. moves were gonna be by using him. Yeah. So, it kind of was like a cool dynamic. It was like that buddy cop thing, like between yeah. him and like Mobius, like where like they hate each other, but like right. they kind of like each other at the same time. Right. So I kind of thought that, mm. that was cool. Yeah, I mean, um, the episode started off with you know they the uh, you know the other Loki taking the commander, and then at nineteen and I think nineteen eighty five or something like that. Mm -hmm. Um, in the where, where early night early nineties, I would say in the eighties, the nineties. Um, and then, you know, taking the reset charges. Because you see that this Loki had been taking reset charges. Yeah. And we're like, what are they taking the reset charges for? Because it's supposed to, way isn't it supposed to essentially supposed reset to, the timeline, yeah, reset right? Yeah, reset the timeline. But, like, eventually we saw that that Loki basically was taking them and took the commander that one time because she gave him the coordinates of the Time Lords, mm -hmm. I think she said. And so they were sending, the other Loki was sending all of those, um, what are they called again? Uh, time charges. The time charges, right. Said all those time chargers to that coordination. Right, but and I thought, see, they said, oh my God, they said like, you know, send it to the team, but they, they didn't send it. She didn't send it. I thought she did. Well, we just, we just spoiled it. Whatever, Loki's, it's a woman Loki. Loki is always a woman Loki, okay? Okay. I Very we, surprising. First of all, I thought that we already knew that because right. gender, it said gender fluid, fluid for so Loki. You, you would, and you then you they think. were never shown the face from the first episode. So I'm automatically assuming that, that it's a she woman. because yeah. they were like, oh, he, he, he. I'm like, yeah. nah, it's a she, yeah, it's, it's a, a woman. She, yeah, so, yeah. 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 So, so, but they, but she was like, she gave the coordinates away to the TBA, mm -hmm. but those reset charges went to the sacred timeline and well, they bombed the sacred timeline. She bombed the sacred timeline. That is nuts. But that part it made me excited because mm -hmm. you saw like the timeline, like the regular, like uh, you know, the regular nice, yeah, the regular straight, straight timeline. timeline, and then it all started breaking that thing, away. I was and that like, made me think oh that that was like the God. part of like the multiverse that Doctor Strange was gonna have to fix in the multiverse <laughs> later of on in the multiverse oh, of madness, yep. maybe. Yep. So when I saw that, I was like. Oh my God! That's, uh, like, all I was thinking was Doctor Strange has to yeah. fix this. I'm like, yo, that, but it's just because then you saw the TVA going like all the phones rang off the hook, mm -hmm. and then you saw them like, oh my God, somebody's bombed the sacred timeline, mm -hmm. and then you just see you see like Sakaar, you mm -hmm. see like Italy, you see like Hong Kong, Japan, mm -hmm. all different type of places in different times, two hundred. 200, yeah, uh, different times. 2300, 1500s. I'm like, yo, this is. This is insane. Mm -hmm. And then the fact that, you know, Loki, you know, they went to, you know, he, he found out that if, um, how the Loki was like hiding. Mm -hmm. And so if there's a catastrophe and everybody in that catastrophe dies, it doesn't, I matter, just, what it doesn't does. matter what he does yeah. during that because they're going to die mm -hmm. anyway. Okay, I'm back, y'all. Anyway, mm -hmm. so it never caused a time anomaly. Yeah. And I was like, that that is smart. That is there's smart. nobody left as a witness to, to whatever the you did. Of whatever happened. Right. So, and so you could keep going back to that catap before that catastrophe. Over and over and over. Over and over and to just hide chill. out and just chill. Right. And then when it you know, everything goes down and just leave. And right. Go somewhere else. <laughs> so I thought that, that was really cool. And I think that this episode showed that there's like a like there might be like a power unbalanced between like I don't know I don't know how to explain it between Loki and like the other like female Loki because mm -hmm. it's like when they showed the other like Loki she had the same like horns that he does yeah and everything so it's kind of like telling me that that one is very similar to the Loki that we know right but she was able to go into people's bodies basically and he, he looked like he didn't know what that was I don't know I don't, could he do that before he I don't think he could imagine how easy it could be if he would could have done that move around right right he could just touch you I'm in you 
Yeah. And now I take control of you. Man, he was Dust Avengers. Yeah. So I don't know. I feel like I feel like Loki thinks that this Loki, like deep down inside, that he thinks that this other Loki is it's stronger superior than to him. him. Right. right. And that's why he keeps saying, "Well, I'm the superior one. I'm the better one. Because yeah. that's the le- that's the lesser one. Because you know right. his ego has to be yeah, like filled, be filled all the yeah. time. So he's like and, and, and always he was like, projecting, like I'm, I'm right. the better. And one. he was telling that Loki, "You could be my <laughs> subordinate lieutenant." Right. <laughs> So you can uh, not subordinate, okay? Right. <laughs> like, you can't be above me. <laughs> right, and so, you know, it, it was very interesting, uh, that, that whole dynamic. And mm-hmm. also, we got a huge Easter egg, and I think the year was 2050. Mm-hmm. Rock song. Basically, rocks card. Rocks card, but it's like rocks rock on. Yeah. And I was like, ooh, we can like get some. And that was 2050, and I think we're in the Marvel Universe because they skipped five years. We're like 223, 24. Around know. that time. I don't know. Because they were five years ahead of where we are at currently. Mm-hmm. And so in like 25 years, I guess, that's, I don't know if rocks on, they're going to go into more rocks on, or in like the next few years, mm-hmm. that rocks on will, you know, you know, build and become a conglomerate, mm-hmm. but that it, it was very interesting, and it also was very interesting with the TVA how they did not care about those people. They said, "Why should no, I care didn't. about those people? If right. They're gonna die like, anyway." I was, I was like, like "God!" Was like, Mobius actually cared. He was like, yeah. "Stop scaring them, please." Right. And then he was just like, "They should be scared. They're gonna die." I'm like, "Um, hold up. <laughs> like, all right, damn." Right. <laughs> like, yeah. I'm like, uh, like I mean, thing. I get it, but like, right. have some decency. Right. <laughs> Come you on. know. So it's it's very interesting, and you know the time lizards. Could you imagine being a multiverse and you see like a crazier version of yourself, or a female version? And then he low key found about Asgard, and I'm getting annihilated. Do you feel like the time lords really exist? I don't I know because so. it because when seems... Mobius was asking about him, because he was like, I never seen him. Because even them. Mobius, who's been there for a long time, he's like, I've never seen them and stuff like yeah. that. Who talked to the other lady, and she was just like, just know that you know they're they're working basically. And I right. was like, so are they really there? Right. You know, like, that's what or, I'm thinking too. I'm or like, are they or, not? They're just a they're just a thing. They're just a created. symbol. Right. It's a that, symbol that y'all created, but you're operating underneath somebody, which right. we think is. Kang the Conqueror. Exactly. Yeah. Because so. one of the TV agents looked extremely like Kang. Mm-hmm. Um, but but yeah, he was basically they were having their existential crisis. Existential crisis. Mm-hmm. Like you know, oh, you're 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 from Asgard, and you guys are supposed to be gods, and mm-hmm. blah blah blah. And look at you, and he was because they was having like comparing, like you're you were born here to be in the TBA, and he was like, why do you have the jet skis? <laughs> And they probably then, I'm pretty sure, like, at the end of the mm-hmm. whole episode, of, like, the whole series, that him and Loki are going to be on jet on skis. On jet skis, maybe. Right? And um, it was just funny because it was like, it was just, he just loves jet skis, and that's why he got the magazine. And then also, mm-hmm. don't forget about the whole thing about Miss Minutes. Miss mm-hmm. Minutes was basically, like, an AI. That, mm-hmm. it, it, he, so, he was fighting it. Right. And it was like, are you alive or not? She's and like, she was like, yes and no. Yeah, I was mm-hmm. like, so you are an AI. You're not, you're not just like, I thought it was just like a cartoon. You're mm-hmm. actually a you're actually AI, a thing. You're, you're a thing. Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh God, um, that's kind of creepy now. Mm-hmm. Um, but he was, he was studying up on, he's studying a lot on the TVA. Yep. Um, I guess, you know. Of so course, he, could, he has to know the, in, the ins and outs. He wants to know the ins and outs because he wants to take over the take TVA. Over. He wants to take, yeah. he realized them. But Mobius knew stone. that too. That's why he was like, you don't try to take us over, right? Right, and then yeah. He's like, no, he's like. Okay. okay, stop the cap. It's like, I know that's what you're trying to do. <laughs> right. Like, on, you stop lying. Me. Yeah. Right. And, yeah, so, very much, there isn't really that much, I, well, Easter eggs that, that I know about. I don't know if you caught any Easter eggs in this episode. But, for pretty much right now, it's straightforward. We haven't really got anything crazy, like, Easter eggs. Yeah, we haven't gotten that. anything that we don't really understand yet. Right, like, but the, oh, so don't forget about the, the Kablooey. Uh, ch- the uh, Kabuli uh, gum mm-hmm. that they mm-hmm. use as an evidence locker mm-hmm. as another hint to go find female Loki. Mm-hmm. And I'm just like, huh? And I'm like, what? what is female Loki's objective? Because she could have, I think she could have easily sent those charges to the TVA unless they don't work. Well, she didn't know the, where it was. What, the TVA's coordinates? Yeah, that's why mm-hmm. she had to get the commander. Right, but then she learned... Because that's what I thought they was going to do. Like, she got, she gave it away. She gave away the coordinates to the TVA. Yeah. And so she was going to send those charges to the TVA. Mm-hmm. And I'm pretty sure if she sent those charges to the TVA, a lot of people would be reset. But I don't know. I don't know, though. Mm-hmm. Because, like, the T... I don't think that the people in the TVA are, like, 
like their existence or them, I guess, dying would matter. Matter? I don't know. I don't know. There's a lot not, of secrecy. It's though. like it's like they're alive, but like not. Time works differently there. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But it's like not. So what would have happened if a research? Because if they did have the baton and they didn't, re they did like the first the first episode they. She hit the, like, you know, with that worker, hit the baton of the stack of stuff, and it, it, it reset. So, obviously, this, their weapon still worked in that t temporal zone. So, what would happen if she threw it down? Instead of her target being a sacred timeline, it'd be the TVA. What would happen? What is what is the female Loki's objective? I don't know. I still don't understand why well, she... Well, it's only the second episode. I know, so. but I'm saying, like, you know how we predict and stuff like that. What, what could possibly be her angle? I don't know. I'm not going with no predictions. Right. No, I, 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 after WandaVision, I have nothing. <laughs> after WandaVision, I have, I have been, nothing. I've been scarred. I have nothing. Okay. Yeah, I, I know. But I'm just I'm just curious. I'm like, what, if she didn't... She oh, was... and it was, a good, it was a cool thing that when, um, as soon as they, like, uh, got out of the TVA and then they got to the place, it was like, got to Rock's car and it was raining and stuff mm -hmm. like that. And then Loki went inside and did his little magic to make himself dry. Yeah. That was like a... That was, that like, was a was slick way of testing... testing. Cause like Stop in the TVA, he couldn't use his powers nope. at all. Nope. And so when he got, I'm back, got out, he just used that one little thing to make him dry. And then he saw that it worked. And she was like, what was that? And he was like, that was me using magic. And then he was like, to dry my clothes. And I was just like, okay, so okay, now so, yeah. he knows that he could use his powers here outside of the outside TVA. Outside of the TVA. He said my so powers still So that he could work. use that later on. Yep, definitely. Yeah. Definitely. That, that's definitely like, Loki is not... Dumb. He's not dumb he's at all. Not dumb at all. Mm -hmm. he, he's very, he's very smart and treacherous. Mm -hmm. um, you know, so I don't know what's gonna happen in this series, man. I really mm -hmm. don't have no idea. I have no happen. idea. I'm just ready for the ride. I just I, I'm all for the ride. All, who doesn't like a time travel story right. and multiverse? Right. It's gonna be so good. I, I definitely think Doctor Strange and the Doctor Strange of Multiverse of Madness. Loki has to be there. He has to be there in some capacity. We already know Wanda is going to be in there. Mm -hmm. But Loki has to be in there because he's also messing with the multiverse too. Yeah. Um, but other than that, I don't know that that scene when she set those charges off in the sacred timeline mm -hmm. and said off. Oh, man. That, ooh, boy. It's going to be excited. Yeah, it's so. going to be excited. Anyway, guys, uh, comment below. Let's respect. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Some more.